Hello everyone, welcome back to Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, and today we are back in the Nibble region. I know it's not been that long since we've been here, but we are definitely going to be doing the side quests backwards. Well, in backwards areas. So we're starting in Nibble. Actually, did I? I see you've secured yourself around. I hope to create a ship of my own one day. Perhaps even an airship. You'll have to join me on its maiden voyage. Okay. I think we got it. Yeah, we got all this. Okay. If okay. there's anything else I can do, I just want to make sure we didn't have any other material we needed to develop. To Where is the? Where's the board at? There it is. I say I knew the board was right here somewhere. Um, also, I don't know if I did this on recording or not, but I did do. I don't think I did. I did these two uh, Queen's Blood people. So at this point, I'm just really only going to be doing the Queen's Blood, uh, the Queen's Blood games that are like you know story based, you know rank, you know like to rank up because those actually have a story to them. But other than that, I, I don't know if I'm even really going to do the show those just because they're Queen's Blood. I mean, you've seen plenty of it early in the game. Sorry. Anyway, all right. So we've got now. We've already taken on. We got the Chocobo Sage. We've got. The Singing Head Chef, which we already did, and the Lament of of the Damned. So that's the new one. <clears throat> okay, so... Well, let's go to the Chocobo Sage first, because that one was actually... And I know this one's actually literally right here, but the Chocobo Sage one actually... was available before, and we didn't do it. So I want to do this one first. So we're going to go to the Chocobo Sage, and then we'll do the uh, Lament of the Damned. Gotta get the items first. Chadley's here. Thanks to your efforts, this area has been... And yet, I'm excited to see what knowledge awaits elsewhere. I don't think there's anything elsewhere. different here. No, there's nothing different. Actually... I have been playing this game for 105, almost 106 hours, and I just now realized that I can switch between the areas and buy the i the buy the materia, like buy the materia that I didn't get. <clears throat> Oh, wait a minute. The Meridian Ocean has stuff. Spare change? Ocean data points. Five. I wonder if it's... I wonder if it's the Proto Relic stuff. The Swift Cast Materia reduces time... Cast time of Linked Materia by 50%. Definitely re-raise is nice. Spare change? Eh, okay. And limit support transfer transfer any increase in limit gauge to allies so that that might help but i really want re-raise and swift cast that's actually <clears throat> you actually we can actually get two re-raises which is nice but how much health do they have when they fall or when they re get re-raised that's the question so we can get two re-raises and then one of each of these so that's nice i did not know the meridian ocean i just found that out too but yeah, I, I, I really just found out that I could sw switch between these. Even though mostly I finished them I finished them all before leaving. But still. Cool. Alright. Thanks, Chadley. I look forward to seeing what new discoveries you make in your travels. Huh? Cloud? Billy? What are you <laughs> Tifa doing just here? like teleported back there. Um... I haven't had much luck at the racetrack lately. Not the good kind, that's for sure. So I came here to train. Train? Here? You don't know where you are? This is the home of THE Chocobo Sage! A living legend! Cloud, sure, how do you not man. know this? Because you lived here. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Did someone say living legend? Oh god, it's Master Roshi! 
Is someone say we're living legend? Bring me a girlfriend and I'll tell you. You okay, sir? Bring me a lady. <clears throat> tell you how to write chocobos. Thought I was a goner. Huh? Mind telling me who you are? There don't get many visitors out here in the boonies. Uh, this is Cloud. He's a jockey for Gramps' ranch. Oh, he is, huh? Perfect. Billy here needs some help. You can pick up the poor boy's slack. There's this big race at the saucer, the Gold Cup, and it's coming up soon. We gotta get in on that, so I came here to bone up. I'm learning all sorts of stuff. See? Hey. Tell me you're not buying this choco dung. Picking garbage out of a pool isn't training. It's manual labor. You see it too, right? I'm just, I'm gonna go middle so road. weird. Come on, he's just jerking you around. I suppose I haven't done much to pick up after him. If you can flap your gums, you can move your gams. Now get on back to your training. Sorry. As for you, I know just the thing. One of my chocobos ran off when we put her out to pasture. Need you to find her. Bring her back. You're asking me? Her name is Selena. Ain't your normal chocobo, neither. Loves the ocean more than home. The way she makes rolling waves look like solid ground. No wonder she thinks she's the bee's knees. Please, Cloud, would you mind? Just <laughs> isn't Selena as a favor for the me? blue chocobo You've we have a already? Gift for wrangling the wild ones. The bird that runs on water? I already found him. There you are, Selena. Well, I underestimated you. Takes real skill to tame this girl. Skills like those of hold on. I know this. I do. Why can't I remember? Oh, damn it! This is gonna bother me all day. Oh. Aha! There we go. It was Sam and Will. What? They were far and away my best disciples. As I was saying, you, Cloud, you may well become as talented a trainer as them one day. Like Roshi and uh, the Crane right? Hurt, the Sam, Crane Hermit, you or the tell Crane. Me everything you know about him. You're gonna give me whiplash, son. The Sam guy you taught. You mean Chocobo Sam out of Midgar? I do, <clears throat> but why do you want to know? Because me and him, we got history. You see, I'm Will's son. Well, don't that beat all? Okay, right. Never forget those two. Doesn't this beat all? Such a powerful passion and an eagerness to learn, too. Everything they did was for the birds. That's not the Sam I know. Sam's a demon. He led my parents to an early grave, got them hooked on gambling, pushed them to rack up tons of debt, and then. Eh, that don't sound like him to me. Oh. You sure you ain't got your Sams mixed up? It's a common name, you know. <clears throat> Only one Sam in this business. I swore that I'd humiliate him by winning the Gold Cup, destroy his reputation, and I'd at least have some kind of revenge for what that bastard did to my parents. Hmm. Now that that's out of your system, back to it. Excuse me? You heard me. Thought you came out here to learn about chocobos, not to get revenge. Uh, Cloud, for your next task, I'll need you to take Selena and gather choco grass, which so happens to grow above bodies of water. You kidding me? This fossil's trying to get us to do his dirty work again? I knew it. <laughs> so how many do we need? Do we need? Do we need all of them? <clears throat> Oh, there's a thumb right there. Grass is a genuine panacea. I kid you not. It'll cure whatever ails you, and then some. And once I am cured, maybe I'll be inclined to share more stories about the good old days. 
He's obviously full of it. If not for him, then please do it for me. I need to know what happened to my dad. <sighs> okay. When I said it grows above water, I meant above. It's called the floating flower, because it grows in the air. But with an ocean chocobo, you can harvest the stuff with ease. You mean like I've already tons done? Ought to do. Best hop to it, Cloud. You don't want my death on your hands, do you? How many do we have? <laughs> we already got 30. <laughs> we got 41. This this side quest is easy. Oh, you get your hands on that choco grass. <clears throat> well, well, if it ain't my beloved choco grass. Yeah, I know. It took this us forever. This can be one hell of a hassle to gather. Thank goodness I had you to get it for me. Okay, so what are you gonna do with it? <laughs> I suppose you've earned the right to know. First, I take this fluff, mix it with some chocobo feathers, and let it ferment. Once it's dry, I boil it all down. Oh boy. Then I squeeze it all out and voila, my patented choco tincture. That's some kind of magic medicine? Oh no, just a little fun. This wrinkly, cheeky old... <laughs> Speaking of grass, if you've got some extra tufts on hand, speaking of grass, sharing them with my assistant at the shop. I promise I'll make it worth your while. Please tell me about my father. Hold your chocobo, son. There's still one thing you need to do for me first. What a surprise! This geezer isn't gonna <clears throat> tell you, Jack. Face it, kid. You got a lot of nerve casting aspersions after all the wisdom I've shared. All the what now? <laughs> all the what so now? I haven't realized you've been training this whole time. Tracking down Selena forced you to get in touch with a chocobo's feelings. And all that running across the water you did helped hone your sense of balance and your bird handling. Key skills for any aspiring jockey. What do you say, Cloud? Bet you feel like a real choco pro by now. Can't say I do. Sounds to me like you need more training. Reckon we ought to add one more item to your regimen. Think of it as a final trial of sorts. Oh, give me a break. Don't go changing the subject here, Gramps. We're not doing your stupid trial. No, it's fine. I'll do it. Then it's settled. I'll be your opponent. And dear Selena will be your steed. If Cloud wins, does that mean you'll finally tell me about my dad? You've got a deal. But know that I won't be pulling any punches out there. When you're ready, give me a holler and we can hit the track. You got any choco grass for me? So I have, what, 11 left? If you find any more, I'll be here. Now how about plumes? Ooh. Totem plume, otherworldly crystal. Beladra horn, which is a weapon for Kate Seth, and cleansing materia earring. Let's trade. Oh, uh, yeah. Ooh. Kind of, ooh, I kind of like those. Oh, yeah, we have enough. Yes. I still don't care for the Scorpion and Shinra ones. Those are stupid. Okay. Wow, Cosmosite Ore costs 10,000 gil. We have 12. Good grief. Ooh, wait. I can buy some oregano, though. I have 77, don't need those. 
Plenty of that. <clears throat> I know the sage is a bit of a handful, but stick with it. Oh. All right. Make a bunch of. We need more sage. Did we actually buy sage? Hey, we couldn't buy sage it'll though, all right? Pay off in the end. I promise. You got any choco grass? Now how about plumes? Right? They don't have sage. They don't have regular sage in here, do they? Oh, they do. I'll see you around. So we'll keep. We I mean, might as well spend the you money. I don't really spend anything at stores. Alright, so. Good luck out there. Thanks. Ooh, materia. Level boost. Okay. I've been using some. Ooh, hello, chest. An elixir. Nice. Hello, birds. All right, so we're going to have to do some race or something. Oh, God. Didn't even realize that was over there. So I have to gather, I want to get, uh, <clears throat> all right. You prepared to undertake the final trial? I'm guessing I have to race you, so sure. Undertake Zoom de Chocobo. Chocobo armband. Best time, well, we don't have a best time yet. Beat this Chocobo Sage. Okay. <sighs> I keep forgetting that these things actually have status. Ooh. Acceleration. Intelligence. Seems like the best setup. <clears throat> oh, wow. I do like that.
Looks a little bit more. So, I can't remember. What's weight? God, it's been a while since I've raced. Can't remember, can't remember, speed up is X. Ah, oh, you son of a... What's up with the water on in front of me? He's like way ahead of me. There ain't no way we're winning this one. lot too okay well <clears throat> try it again try it again try it again Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Alright, 
How do you dash? I don't remember. Oh, you... No way we were winning that one. I gotta remember how to do a dash. L1, I think. I could have shot that? There we go. Okay. Yay, Chocobo Armband! Looks like all that training I made you do paid off. No, no. Thanks to my regimen, I'd say you're head and shoulders above your average amateur. Wouldn't you agree? As much as I'd love to tell you you're wrong because I think you're the worst, you do have a point. <laughs> Even the worst can teach you a thing or two if you let them. A promise is a promise, sir. <clears throat> Please tell me more about my dad and Uncle Sam. Hmm. All right, then. What do you want to know? The crane know? hermit and the turtle hermit. Let's see. They couldn't have been much older than you are now. The two of them came and asked me to take them under my wing. Turned them down, seeing as I'd already retired. But they hung around the grounds anyway. Since they had nothing better to do, I put them to work. And that's how it all began. Oh. Well, wasn't nothing out of the ordinary, I'd say. Ran some errands, did some repairs, helped around the house. You know, your standard training regimen. And in their downtime, they took it upon themselves to dig through my library, learning about chocobos and how to handle them. Came to differing conclusions. They used to argue something fierce. I can't say the two of them got on terribly well. I figured. Will and Sam had mighty strong opinions about how to best raise chocobos, and it drove them to fight with their words and with their fists. That said, only reason those two fought as hard as they did is because they both cared deeply about the cause. As far as passion is concerned, the two of them were birds of a feather. <clears throat> That's it? Hmm. How you feel now? Managed to sort out the mess inside? Uh, uh, what do you mean? When we first met, I saw the way your eyes were brimming with anger. 
I knew right then and there that what you needed wasn't teaching or training. What you needed was time. Time to look deep inside yourself and clear out all the wickedness and spite that have been haunting your heart. Plus, his house needed a good Which cleaning. Which is why you had him clean out the pool? Exactly. I don't know what happened to your father after he left this place. And I can understand why he'd want to beat old Sam in a race. <clears throat> Few things feel better than sticking it to someone who did you wrong. But that being said, you should never use your birds as tools for revenge. Ask yourself. Use a buster why sword. Why did I decide to start raising chocobos? I guess. I guess it's because I saw how happy those birds made my mom and dad. How they'd smile. The chocobos brought us a lot of fun and brought us together as a family. I guess that's why. Good enough. The why is important, so don't forget yours. I reckon Sam's got his eyes on the gold cup. Keep yours unclouded by hatred, and you'll do fine. Thank you, sir. Thanks for everything. I'm gonna head back to the saucer, make sure our birds are ready for the big race. Don't worry about putting your name in. I'll take care of it. All you need to do is show up and win. Just show up whenever. New quests are available at the Corel region. Ah. Uh, nice chocobo spot. <laughs> I love Barrett's look. He's like, dude, get out of the water. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, where's Tifa? Oh, there she is. She's, she's hidden behind Barret. Sad we don't have Keatseth right now, but, you know. I mean, it's okay. So, why is this here? Just no reason? Okay. Okay, well, I guess we've got... Sith's other a bit, uh, weapon we need. So we have to gather, what was it? Was it 45 or was it, I don't remember what it was, but I mean, they're still... Let's head back up to Nibelheim. We've got one other quest to do in Nibelheim. <clears throat> Actually, wait a minute. What what quest opened up in Corel? Do we just want to go do that now? Since it's kind of a part of the same thingy thingy. said a new one opened up in Corel, but... We're gonna stick to Nibelheim. Usually they'll... <clears throat> Keep watch to make sure the patients don't wander off into the world. You're Shinra? Shinra? It's the ghost of 
of someone who used to live there a long time ago. Uh, hi, Shinra dude. Someone needs to clean up all those feed carcasses. Okay. Back again, are we? What is it this time? Well, they're gone now. Or what was left of them. Some Shinra troopers helped dispose of their remains. How they got in, however, remains unclear. But that's for someone else to figure out. We're still struggling with the loss of Mr. Murasaki. Shinra's created a refuge for those suffering from Mako poisoning. Here they can relax and recover in their own time. Yeah, I don't think they're recovering. But recently, some have up and left without a word. Which is frankly beyond me. I'm the manager of the manor only on paper. I know next to nothing about it. Records indicate it was built as a research facility on land borrowed from the village back in Shinra's early days. The work carried out at the facility, however, was apparently quite sensitive. Pretty much all the details <clears throat> have been redacted. Really makes you wonder what they're trying to conceal. By the way, you spent an awful long time inside Shinra Manor. What were you doing in there? We... needed to use the terminal. That's all, was it? Why do you ask? Well, you see, ever since your visit, I've been hearing this strange voice. A woman's, coming from inside. I know this sounds crazy, but you don't think it's haunted, do you? Hardly. Besides, you're the manager. Ain't it your job to investigate? No. I don't have the clearance to set even one foot inside. Regardless, I know what I heard. It wasn't just the wind rustling through the trees at night. Someone was weeping. Almost musically. It sounded like a woman wailing. For real? I'm afraid so. Barrett's Even like, I don't I like the ghost. Thing until you went inside, it's clear there's a connection. Why not take some responsibility and go investigate for me? I think I'm gonna sit this one out. <laughs> hey. Come on. I'm sure it's nothing serious. Yeah. All right. I'll take I'll take Red and Yuffie in because they're not scared of anything. <clears throat> I wonder if I should take UVM. What? The what? I ain't giving you no problems, officer. Time to go. <laughs> well, I don't hear a damn thing. So, case closed. No need for us to overstay our welcome. What are you doing? No, Be quiet. Listen. Uh, you hear something I don't? I feel it below us. Well, I don't feel anything. But you know this place better than we do. If you're willing to lead, we'll follow. What do you mean, we? <laughs> scared. Me? Scared? <laughs> I ain't been scared a day in my life. I was even voted bravest buddy back in the day. Of course you were. Man, this is ridiculous. That guy was convinced there's some kind of ghost in here. But I'm not buying it. I say we just turn around. Getting cold feet? Of course not. Besides, it wouldn't be our first paranormal encounter. Like the gay. They were ghosts. I think. Huh. 
What was that? I uh. heard it right. Loud and clear. Loud and clear. Sounds nothing like the gee we know. Then what is it? We'll soon find out. <sighs> Vincent, what's the deal with you and Sephiroth? How do you know him? Our bond is unique. I'm to blame in part for the evils he's unleashed. I've had many opportunities to purge him from this world. Unfortunately, I couldn't pull the trigger. Don't beat yourself up. Oh? I don't know if you can kill him. And even if you could, I think he'd stick with you. Somehow. <laughs> Quite the rosy outlook. To need my key card. It'll grant you access to the lower levels. Oh, great. So, lower levels. This is an area we've never been to before, so. The simulator is up ahead. Can't proceed further until we complete the trial. Oh, God. Best of luck. Bless me. Okay. Great. No, Hojo. Greetings and welcome, my lovely specimens. This asshole again. Today is your lucky day. You'll be participating in a series of combat simulations. Few are permitted to take part in mine. Be grateful for this honor. Well, without further ado, let us begin. I look forward to analyzing the data gleaned from your deaths. Messy as they'll be. Oh boy. Aerial specimens. We'll take Barrett since it's aerial specimens. Having ranged people probably is the best idea.
Yay! All done. Excellent! That performance bodes well for the next trial. Wait, what is this one? Ruthless, ruthless trial. <clears throat> so, use our ground and pounders. Oh God. Hey, we beat him in the time limit. I wasn't even paying attention to the time limit, to be truth be told. A watcher's work is never done. Hmm. Comparable is, but Cloud, Era, Yuffie. I guess that's two ranged people, but whatever. Oh no. Oh, so I can still assess, right? Becomes pressured when either head is incapacitated, but the remaining head will go berserk. Keep it together. I'll show you what I can do. Okay.
Okay. Was he dead? Cannot revive. <clears throat> Let's just do it. <clears throat> Got 58 seconds. Do your thing. So I don't know how long Alexander's gonna be here, but any support we can get at this point, the better. We gotta stagger him too. No matter if I with powerful offensive abilities. Sure. There we go. Stagger. Okay. <clears throat> Time to get serious. All right. So he's done. Sneeze, now my nose is going crazy. Let's go. Not exactly the best team, but <clears throat> an intriguing result indeed. Miss Michael. Let's see how you perform in the final trial. Okay. Final trial. Bio selected. Ooh, item master material. I think we've already got two of those, but still, that's always nice. <clears throat> I think we're just going to go with the, the main team we got right now. All right. Oh, boy. You get on the time of stagger enemies twice? Boy. I'm gonna hit him. Let's finish this. Oh, we don't have to stagger each enemy twice. We just have to stagger both enemies. See, they do not. They do not specify, and that is not... Why didn't you switch and then switch back? Ooh, my ice materia improved. star hotel donate oh 30 items to the treasure trove and johnny seaside end. okay marvelous you've cleared every trial 
<laughs> I've created masterpieces yet again, I see. Without further ado, my dear specimens, Wait, let's proceed act two. with act two. Oh no. Is there anything in here? <clears throat> you mentioned some gal used to work here, but what exactly did she do? Whatever the good professor bade her, as their bodyguard, I was never made privy to the details of their research. Well, knowing that sick freak, I doubt he was up to anything good. And I bet that gal wasn't much better than him either. That's not true. Oof. Did I touch a nerve? Ah, uh, look, I see it. I have to concentrate. You know, deep down, I knew you'd make it this far. Well, we ran of down a hallway. Not every participant does. Only the finest, <clears throat> the elite among you, survive. You should be very proud. I, for one, am delighted by your success. Where are you off to? To shut him up. As a token of my appreciation, I prepared for you a gift. Okay. That's what we've all been hearing? You gotta be kidding me. Here it is, your final trial. You must face this fiend in combat and emerge triumphant or die. Oh, God. Allow me. What's weak against ice? Uh, impervious to physical attacks from the rear, inflicting enough damage during subdue. When its HP is low, all attacks will inflict poison. Fantastic! Yeah. <laughs> Here's an antidote. There we go. Now, I'll get him. My turn. <laughs> Somebody just got Blizzard. Just get started. 
This means we busted our ghost. A monster. Tainted by Hojo's touch, no doubt. Why the singing, though? An outlet for stress, perhaps. An expression of displeasure. Despite their appearance, some fiends are capable of complex thinking and experiencing emotions. <laughs> right. Monsters got feelings. <laughs> I know we ought to have mercy for all life, but you gotta draw the line somewhere. In any case, thanks for your help with the investigation. Don't oh. stay too long. Uh, Hojo's AI has added a new test and trials to the Mako Research Facilities Combat Simulator. Undertake them at your peril. Ooh. Hey, Barrett's full. Boy, I hope we get the Barrett date now. Wow, clouds level 47. Probably nothing this way. I don't know. Do we try Hoja? Eh, no, we're at an hour, so we'll just wrap it up here. I might take a look at it off, off, uh, off recording. But anyway, so with all that being said, everybody, thank you very much for joining me here. If you haven't already, please like, share, and subscribe to Moktos Gaming. Also, please consider becoming a member. It helps support us in what we do, and it just, you know, the support goes a long way for us. So uh, thank you very much for watching, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Catch you later.